So to make this double exposure effect, I will use these three pictures here and this is the main face of the double exposure and these are the two images which I will use to make the double exposure effect. Okay, so first image is this one. Okay, and I will make sure that till the neck part here, this image stays. So I will first bring, I add another page and bring this picture here and just cover it to the whole cam canvas here. And after that, here in this page, I will just crop this part okay and paste it here and make this bigger I will keep it like this and after that I will just use this image copy it by pressing ctrl plus C in the keyboard and just paste it here by pressing ctrl plus V in the keyboard and just decrease the transparency so that I can check the main character's image where it is coming. So it is coming in the face area. So I will just bring it down. Okay, like this. And now it is looking okay. So after that, I will just use this image here. Scroll down to apps. Here write blend and select this app which is says image blender. Okay and I will just rotate it because I want to make the blending effect in the upper portion. So I will just keep it in a straight line like this. Okay, let's make it a straight line. Okay, so this part is done like this. Click on save. So this part is ready. Now let's uncrop this part to check it here if the blending is working fine or not. So this is working fine. Now I will just delete this image and create the upper part here. So for that I will go again go to uploads. and use this image and I will first use BG remover and I will just bring it right here and right click it go to layer send to back okay so like this it is visible okay and again I will bring this image in the first image and again I will check it here and we need to just middle this image so for that I will just hold this image and move it right here like this okay just uncrop this part because this is not required and just make it slightly bigger like this okay and let's see if it is working fine or not so it is working fine as you can see in here you can also make it some bigger so let's do it like this okay so it is now in a perfect shape and now i will delete this main image and i will just make the background black okay but as you can see when i make the background black the image is not visible so to make it visible i will go to elements and here i will write white glow okay I will use this first one and I will just bring it right here make it slightly bigger and paste it here and right click it go to layer send to back and now you can just highlight the image here okay like this and now it is highlighted okay now download the first page 
make sure it is in jpg and select the current page only because i want to download only the page one click on download okay so the image is downloaded now i will click on add page and re-upload this image okay and i will scroll down to apps here i will use this blend image app and for the bottom layer i will use this image click on use selected image and for the top layer i will use this image and as the blending mode is in screen so no more editing needs to be done click on add page and just add the design and now the design is ready and this is the tutorial which i wanted to share with you and this is a double exposure effect and this is a couple version of this double exposure effect hope you like this tutorial and please subscribe to the channel for more amazing tutorials like this thank you